Yeah. Are you guys with Latter Day Saints? Yeah. I'll listen to you if you listen to me. What you got? You guys ever taken acid before? No. You should take acid sometime. Go out into nature, take acid, or just take a walk, and and read about the geologic time scale. Okay, you don't even fuck the acid. You don't even need to do this. Just read about the geologic time scale. Learn your landmarks on it. You know how old the Earth is, right? 4.3 billion years old. Evolution of life, roughly dated at 3.8 billion years. You, you follow where I'm going here? This is a real origin story, and you can make it work with religion. It's not exclusive to religion. You can. This is, you know, humans are killing the the world, right? By this fucked up mindset we have that's disconnected from reality and, and nature and everything. Nature's just the real world. Everything we made is kind of fake. But, you know, you can make religion jive with it. Do you guys ever do that? Like, where are you from originally? I'm from Utah. Utah's beautiful. Beautiful geology, beautiful plants. There are many plants that are endemic to Utah. You know what endemic means? It means they only grow in Utah. Mm -hmm. it's fascinating stuff. They're, they're, they're selected for, for, you know, the gypsum soils in Washington County in the south. Lots of gypsum endemics. They grow in gypsum deserts. You can only find them on gypsum soils, which are remnants of, you know, Cretaceous oceans. It's like, you know, estuaries. Gypsum coal occurs with limestone a lot. Utah's got beautiful stuff. Go out into Utah, find some nature, and you can figure, I bet you can figure out a way to make your religion work with loving the natural world and, and you know, pulling yourself away from the, the money-grubbing, shiny mindset that humans have that's killing the earth right now, too, right? You could do that, right? Jesus... Assuming he exists, I assume he exists, probably a good guy. Problem with a lot of Christians is they're really hung up on the creepy Old Testament stuff, not on the words of Jesus, right? Jesus probably respected the earth, right? You could you could make it work, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You could look kind of bored. No. I'm being serious, though. You could make it no, work. I just like, I, I got, yeah. yeah, but you know... I'm like confused. Do you want to come to church or no? No, I don't, not at all. I got okay. church. It's called nature, but I'm just saying... But I'm just saying, oh, you only want to talk to me if I'm going to join your club. No. That's see, I don't need you to join my club. I don't need you want to. I don't need you to join my club. I just need you to hear what I'm saying. You can make it work with your religion, you know. I'm trying to help people that are disconnected from the living world and help them reassociate with it, though. Yeah. No, I'm not saying you are. I'm saying we all are. We grow up indoctrinated into this stuff. But that's the real religion. Yeah, good, good luck to you guys. I, I, you've probably noticed a lot of Christians don't actually follow the word of Christ. They're more hung up on, like, the creepy, hateful stuff, hating gays, weird, creepy, racist shit, you know, stuff like that. I'm not saying you guys are, but I'm just saying you know that's part of the religion, right? You guys, hey, no, 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 you guys, hey, you guys are running away from me now. I was running away from you back there, and then I thought about it, and I was like, wait, let me try and indoctrinate them, right? Right, okay, well, good luck. Take care. If I knew it was this easy to get rid of Mormons, I'd do it more often. Take care. Have fun. Go out into nature. Utah's beautiful.